All right, we are here on the Sea Pro 240A Bay Boat. And we got six guys fishing here all at one time. See them all behind me. All American military, of course. And we got our Sea Pro pressurized live well up in the bow. We have one in the stern and the bow on the Sea Pro. And this is how it works. You can adjust the water down here to come in. We got a rate where it just stops close to the surface of the well just slightly faster you see it'll come up to the water if i let it go and it just squeezes all the air out you will see that this will just squeeze the air right out see it coming up And the reason the pressurized is good is for when we're riding in a real rough chop on the way back. Yeah, you know, it's in the waves, we're not going to beat up our catch here. All right, I just showed you the pressurized well at the bow. And of course, we have one at the stern as well. Same as the front, 30 gallon pressurized. Awesome, awesome, awesome. And these are the valves down here. We have the bow well here. The stern well is here, and here's the valve. We can right all the way down is full drain. We can position it in the middle anywhere we want to get whatever level. What I do is I leave it at half permanently all the time. I leave it at half, and then once it's at half, I can control my level right at the flow knob. I can put two inches of water in there, three inches of water, four inches, four and a half, whatever I want. If I only have get a couple baits, two inches is great. If I want to fill it all the way to the top and run it as a pressurized well, I can. Man, I love it. There's no overflow stem in the middle. It gets you hung up on your nets and bait smashing. Such a great design. Home run, see, bro. Another home run. Well done. There's no water. Max! <laughs> Max, oh. <laughs> Max, what are you doing? He went right in the live well. What are you doing? Are you all right, Max? 